In our Capital Connection tonight, abortion bills are getting their first hearing this year in the General Assembly. This on the same day that the anti-abortion March for Life is happening in Washington. An opposing march is planned for Sunday. Here at home, those bills aren't likely to become law anytime soon. 8 News reporter Olivia Jaquith is live in our digital center tonight to tell us why. Olivia, good evening. Good evening, Eric. Well, these three measures would have placed bans on abortions here in the Commonwealth after certain time frames, but they didn't get enough support during this morning's Health Professions Subcommittee meeting. Democrats say they will continue to defend reproductive rights, while Republicans like Senator Siobhan Donovan say opponents have demonstrated their unwillingness to find a solution. Three proposals that would have moved up the timeline for permitted abortions in Virginia not moving forward at this time in the General Assembly. Senate Bill 1483. It seeks to restrict abortion in the third trimester to only life of the mother. Currently in code, we allow an abortion for a mental or physical illness of the mother. Banning abortions after 24 weeks. Senate Bill 1385. We wanted to find a bill uh, that had what we thought was more broad support by Virginians, too, that uh, initiated itself at what we understand to be pain capable. Banning abortions after 15 weeks and Senate Bill 1284. I understand that in the passing of legislation that there is a duty and a commitment to support these children not only inside the womb but also outside the womb. Instituting a total ban on abortions except in cases of rape, incest and jeopardizing the life of the mother. Senator Siobhan Donovan behind the 24-week proposal breaking from party lines this morning to vote against the other two bills. Elected officials heard testimony from both sides ultimately moving forward without a change in current law. My world may have changed but there are braver options than abortion. Women deserve the support like I got and most of all baby like mine deserve a chance to live. I'm a mother who chose to have an abortion after 20 weeks. I urge you to reject the abortion bans before you today. Everyone deserves the chance to make their own choice. Now, lawmakers voted to pass by these measures indefinitely, meaning abortion remains legal in the Commonwealth through the second trimester. That decision is expected to be upheld by the full committee next week. Live in the Digital Center, Olivia Jaquith, 8 News.